With T-Shirt Texture Machine and Adobe Photoshop, it's very easy to flip through the textures applied to your graphic to see which one works the best. In Adobe Illustrator, it's a little different. I had a customer ask me this, so I'll show you the best way I know to flip through the texture options. So first of all, there are 21 options here, and it comes with a preview file like this where you can see swatches of the textures but the best way to preview them on your graphic is to go ahead and apply a texture. So let's go ahead and place one of the textures. Let's just start with the first one. This one's called Smudge Dots. And let's scale the texture to cover our graphic. And what we'll do here is I have this graphic set up with a background color behind it just to visualize and then the graphic on the top layer and the graphic is grouped. Now I've placed the texture on top of that grouped graphic. So what we'll do here is select everything except the background and let's go to our transparency window, window transparency, click make mask and then toggle the clip and invert mask options there until you get something that, that looks correct. And now, okay, let's say we wanted to try a different texture. What we can do is let's go to Window Links and you'll see that Smudge Dots image there. We can just click Relink and go right back to our list of textures. That one's Big Half Tones. And then we can highlight it, do it again. Let's try one called Boogie. And we can do that again. Let's try linen. And just one more time, click that relink. We'll try beat grit. So that is how to flip through the texture options applied to your graphic in Adobe Illustrator. Thanks for watching.